Fox 10 News at 9 with John Hook and Kerry Lane. And some people call it miracle water. Does it really cure disease? We take a look coming up next, only on Fox. Only on Fox, is it water or something much more? We first told you about this back in July when we profiled a man whose health problems went away when he started drinking this concoction regularly. It's called Peralgezyme, and now two more Valley men have come forward with their amazing story. They say their HIV is under control since they started drinking this special water. These two men are life partners. We'll call them John and Steve. Besides sharing a home in Phoenix, they also have something else in common. They are both HIV positive and have been for more than 15 years. 18 years ago when you found out you were HIV positive, mm -hmm. was that at the, I don't even know, historically? 1987 is that when I found out. When it was, Everybody was It was a death sentence. Yeah, it was a death sentence. Everybody was dying. Everybody gave you 18 months to live. Yeah. I said, months. I'm not going down that road. AZT, Norvine, the so-called cocktail meds. The pair have been on them all, trying to fight off the virus. And then in July of this year, Steve saw a story on Only on Fox about a man named Dennis Gorman. Gorman had been diagnosed with prostate cancer. But the cancer had apparently gone away after he started drinking something called Peralgezyme. His words to me were, Dennis, I see no signs of cancer. To Steve, it was a sign. Well, the first thing that I, that I thought was, if, if this man uh, can be cured, uh, from prostate cancer that I thought it could help me with my HIV. My partner said, you've got to see this clip on the news tonight. And I watched and I went, okay, it works for that person. What is it going to do for us? Well, my partner placed the order and said, we need to take this. I was just so positive about it and said, you know, what do we have to lose? These algae-filled aquariums are where Peralgezyme comes from. Howard Bear runs health enhancement products, the Scottsdale company that makes Peralgezyme. We don't touch the algae. We draw the water down. We'll draw half of the tank down. We filter it, bottle it, and that's it. This stuff is totally untouched by human hands. We don't change any of the makeup of it. We, we literally do nothing to it. What Bear knows about Peralgezyme is that it contains proteins, aminos, and some active bacteria. But what no one seems to be able to do is identify the specific algae in these tanks. We filed our first patents and sent it to the patent office in Washington. They normally get back to you in about three or four weeks. They were eight weeks out on us, didn't come back to us, we were chasing them. They finally admitted they couldn't find the algae documented any place. So we have something that nobody else has, we, we think. What John and Steve think is that they've found the fountain of youth. How do you think this stuff works? I don't know. We call it magic water. In July, the two started drinking a few ounces of Peralgezyme every day, along with their prescribed antivirals. Within weeks, some long-time common side effects of their medications started to disappear. I feel great. Have you noticed have, a difference? I have no more nausea, no more vomiting. No more acid reflux. Before taking Peralgezyme, uh, I literally would stay in bed three-fourths of the day just so I'd have the energy to fix dinner at night. And uh, my energy level is really great now. But those weren't the most stunning developments. Those happened when they went for their quarterly blood test. One thing that the tests monitor are viral loads, or the amount of virus in the blood. The higher the number, the sicker the patient. In March of 2005, Steve's viral load was 13,127, which means he was starting to get very ill. Six weeks after daily doses of Proalgezyme, blood tests showed his viral load had been reduced dramatically. My viral load was undetectable. It was the same good news for John. I started Proalgezyme in July, and by the end of August, my viral load was undetectable. Even his doctor was stunned. And when he saw these numbers, what was his reaction? His reaction says, I don't know what you're doing. Keep doing it. HIV specialist Foster Easley right. is Steve's doctor. It is amazing, and, it, and it's something I'm looking into. I, 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 it's piqued my interest, let's, let's put it that way. Is it a placebo effect? I don't know, because it, he does seem to be a lot better. Um, you know, 
certainly the numbers can